Hello guys, um, I got a lot of questions about how to buy a stock from the support line. Now, I made a training level about that and it is, uh, if you go to my website you'll find it. But I will try just to give you um, a general idea about how to buy a stock from the support line. Now, the general idea is it's not easy. When you see a stock that has been going down for long, maybe one week, one month, six months, one year, two years, and then suddenly it comes back and it begins going up. Okay? I'm not saying that you, that you buy the stock at $100 and you lose all your money until the stock will become ten dollars and then and then you will be happy that it's going up no i'm not speaking about that i'm speaking about when you uh you are looking or you are having some stocks you are interested in them because they have a high volume because maybe they are these stocks are famous companies and uh, you are just curious to trade them because um because first they are famous second they move fast now third uh, they you can make money from them if you know how to trade them an example of these stocks i have given you before like facebook like twitter like apple like bigger one like google now these kind of stocks are very robust stocks strong when they go down or when they go up so sometimes you should see the index where this stock belong to okay is the stock going down by itself by itself it means it means let's say the, the index is going up the chart when you see it is going up and you see your stock that you want to buy is going down. What does it mean, this situation? This situation means... Let's drink some coffee. This situation means that there are some mutual funds or big traders. They are selling off this stock. Okay? Now... When they are selling off, other guys comes to short the stock because it's going down. And when it's going down, they take advantage of this big move of the stock down. So they short in order to make some money. And this is what the short sellers do. And most of them are day traders. Okay, some, uh, some uh, swing traders do the same. But it's so risky with the swing trading. Now. If the stock goes down by itself, it doesn't follow um, the index. It's a situation. This stock is what we call solo stock. I always use this word solo. It means alone. Okay? It's going down by itself. It has nothing to do with the index. Because if the, st if the index is going up, it means that a lot of mutual funds are buying in that index. Okay? Since they are buying, you find the, the best stocks, the strongest one, going so fast the first. And then the crappy stocks or the, the slower one uh, follows later. That's why a lot of swing traders like me, like other people, like you, if you are doing swing trading, they follow these moves. Now, when a stock is going by itself down, I give you an example. Twitter, for example. Uh, I have made a lot of videos about Twitter. Now, why I made a lot of videos about Twitter? Twitter is very famous, and a lot of people, a lot of companies use it, all the world use it, so it's very famous. But, a lot of investors 
have exit this trade it means or this investment a lot of mutual fund now when i say to you oh you tell me how do you know uh, which are these uh, mutual funds where are they where do you get this information i don't get this information from uh, the media for me i understand i read between the lines as they said let's drink some coffee. this is like a, an ad <coughs> inside my video so i drink some coffee now as you know me for many years what is the thing that i am concerned with and focus on always is price i don't care what the other people do what the people said what the people what the analysts say and most of the people online who use reasons who use causes who uses uh, uh, to find why the stock goes down and they begin to have reasons i am not concerned with that because most of them they lie the company when it gives information it can lie what does it mean you say oh how can how can a company lie yes it can lie in the numbers they mix numbers you don't understand and no one understands okay because the company gives the information either it can't be exact 100 percent the information okay that's why that's why the people rely on the company's news company's information and when they rely on that what will happen it means if the company lies you get false information and then you do bad decisions that's why sometimes you find online information you find for example uh this company is excellent it has a lot of earnings it has done this and this uh it's over all the competition it has uh, new uh, products it's it's the company that has everything okay and all the people they say good about it analysts they say good everyone say good about it you read your inf the information or the uh, financial statement of the company all is good but when you go to the price you want to buy and you see the stock was sixty dollars and now it is ten dollars and you say to yourself if this company is good why the mutual fans they don't buy it mutual fund they know better than me and than you they know what to buy okay they try to make sure things are okay in order to buy this stock and to make a commitment because mutual fund when they buy they buy a lot from a company that's why the stock goes up and up and up what 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 makes facebook uh, goes from 17 dollars 55 three years ago and now it's it's more than 104 or five dollars now who it's mutual fans because they know something that most of the people they don't know okay the public what they say the public i and you and everyone but fortunately for us we have one thing that if you focus on you will have no trouble at all in the market you tell me what's this thing what's this thing what's this thing it's price because the price does not lie now why it doesn't lie because you see it in each second you go you open your account you see your stuff your stocks that you have in your account and you see the regular price right now with the cents your stock is ten dollars fifty one cents and some other minus thing okay this is your stock if you buy it by seven and now it's ten you make a, you you make a, a nice profit but if it was 15 and now it is ten, oh man you have a big loss and uh, you lost a lot of money and it that's why it's very important you see colors if you have some uh some problems with your eyes with colors 
you should you should if you should use for example if you see only the white and the black you should uh, see the broker in order to make uh, the numbers with these colors okay now but you, I know most of you have good eyes better than me I have glasses okay but you should uh, try to understand that colors doesn't lie also if you open your account you see your account in green what does it mean it means you are making money even it is one dollar it is you are making money but if you see your account is in red which is danger you you know that you are losing money either you lose one dollar or one hundred dollar ten thousand dollars one hundred thousand dollars it doesn't matter what matters is that you are losing money now we go back to our subject now when the stock goes down it goes down it goes down but one time it stops and it it goes up again and it begins to make a trend up so how do you know that the only thing that makes you commit to buy this stock is when you see it stop and it's going up there is no other way it's not the market that says, sends you a message or text message or an email and telling you oh man this stock has stopped and it begin to go up go and buy it okay and it's a sure thing since from the first day I was doing videos about stocks I told you there is no sure things in the market so from now on try to make sure that trading is taking your opinion as serious you see the stock going down and then it stops one day or two it goes up now you buy now who tells you that the stock will go up or down okay it's just an opinion that you have about the market now the only thing that you expect is that your stock will go up 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 and you make money and there will be the good trend that you are waiting for okay it's just an attempt now if you you are serious okay serious about trading when you see an opportunity and you see a good stock stops going down begins to go up you buy whatever is this stock okay I'm not concerned with this stock it's just stock okay now in a few days few weeks if the stock is continuing going up you are right and you have a sure money because the stock is going up your money is there now what's the problem the problem is if the stock when you buy it, it it goes one day or two and then it goes down down and it hits a new low this is an exit try to exit as fast as you can because if it goes below that low that the stock has done before I, I have I have shown you this in um, in Twitter I have done so many videos explaining to you when the when the stock was near the low and I told you if it hits that low it means it continues to go low okay some people they short it and they can make uh, much um, uh, they can make uh, money but uh, in swing trading some people they do day trading these are what you call technical analysis technical analysis is you see the price because it doesn't lie okay they don't see fundamentals and the company is good or bad or uh, the CEO is a nice guy or he, he was in Harvard University or wherever no you see the price because the price makes you the money or you lose the money because of it so it's it's the focus now there are some training that you should know a lot of science that you should acquire and this needs a practice 
That's why I have made my uh, training level called how to buy stock from the support line. And I will uh, I, I show a lot of stuff. Some people who have um, uh, bought or ordered this training, they they have more information than general people who have never who who don't know when or where or to buy this thing. Okay, so the basic thing in how to buy from support line is to see if you have a list, for example, of stocks that you that you want to buy in the future. Even if you if you like these companies because they have a good fundamentals, for example, you you know a lot about fundamentals. Uh, for me, I don't believe in that stuff, but you 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 believe in them. Okay, believe in them. Put these stocks in a, a chart and wait for an opportunity to come and buy. You come you can buy. Uh, it's not important to buy a lot. No, just buy some and then wait. If the stock is going up and you think that you are right, you can buy more. And if it stays one month or two or three, believe me, you will make a lot of money from this. Okay? So, um, this, is, this is all for this video. Please, if you have any question or if you have comment, just straight back. Now, if you want to just take a look at the training level, just take a look, a look at it try to see what's going what's included uh, if you have bought it if you have uh, ordered it uh, already thank you very much it it will help you a lot if you have many questions just uh, at the bottom here you have my uh, website and you have the uh we have the um uh the email just email me thank you very much and have a nice day